Hey there guys, um, today I'm going to be doing, uh, uh, I'm going to be showing off my paper currency collection. And it's not as big as my coin collection, obviously. But it's still pretty good. So first to start off, I have this $2 bill from 1976. This is in my dad's tape deposit box. It's kind of cool because it's technically a bicentennial, but not really because it doesn't have anything special about it. It was made in 1976 and 1776, but yeah, nothing really special. These sell for like $18 though. They're really expensive. Probably less than that, but really expensive. Here's a silver certificate. I got, an I got it at an antique store. 1935D. Nothing really special. And then I got this one, which is very cool. Um. It has four ones, one, 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 and also only has four letters, six, one, 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 two, three, two. So yeah, that one's my, probably my favorite. Here's a red steel $2 bill. I really wanted one of these. 1928. Very nice condition. Monticello on the back. Very nice. Here's what started my collection, this, um, star note. I, wrote, I was really excited when I got this at the at te, uh, ironically I got it at the Eisenhower Museum. So yeah, that's pretty cool. I have here's my first 1976 two dollar bill. Someone probably folded it up super weird. The yeah, it's in okay condition. I got this for free, so someone gave it to me. And then I have a totally real two dollar bill. From the disgruntled states of America. And here's the my favorite part of my collection. This Confederate five dollar bill. And I got this for like six dollars. It's amazing. Pretty sure those are some slaves working in the fields, and there's like I don't know whose house that is, but you can actually see the real Confederate flag up there. Pretty cool. I don't know who that is, but it looks like someone like Jefferson Davis, maybe. And the, in case you didn't know, this was a five dollar bill. So yeah, that's basically it to my collection. Uh, please put any comments in the comment section. And thanks for watching.